Hey there and welcome to the video. In today's video I'm going to be demonstrating inside of VMware uh, a PFSense machine and specifically I'm going to be configuring a host only network and I'm going to attach that host only network to my PFSense machine and the unique thing that we're going to be doing, going to be doing in this configuration as well is that I, I'm going to be having uh, the DHCP turned off on this host only. So this is a, this is a host only network where all of the IP addresses are going to be static. Okay, and let's double check that we have a host only network. Edit, virtual network editor. Change settings. And we're gonna go and look at this guy here, let's say. So I've got a VMNet 3 host only, so I could make a new one. And that's it's pretty easy. Just click on it. Uh, but I have one here that I'm actually going to play around with. Um, I want it to be a host only. I but I don't want to have DHCP uh, enabled. So I'm going to actually unclick that there, and I could change this network to whatever I want. So here I'm. I'm just going to keep it as 16. So I got 192.168.16.0, and we're going to hit oh, apply. And OK. And so now I want to actually turn my PFSense machine off. And we're going to go into the settings for this virtual machine. And we're going to add another interface. Network adapter. It's, it comes on down here. And I would like that to be my VMNet 3, the one that we just uh, modified. So we've, we've attached it. Now let's go ahead and turn this machine back on. Okay, so we have booted our PFSense machine, and right away we can see that we got our WAN, we have our LAN, but we actually don't see the other interface. So first things first, we need to actually assign an interface. One. Do you want to set up a VLAN right now? No. We are going to, so the WAN already exists, but even if we go up and look at the available interfaces. We have our WAN, EM0, we have our LAN, EM1, and then we have uh, EM2, our third interface that we just set up. We're going to follow the instructions on the, on the screen here. Enter the WAN interface. Enter the LAN, which is for us is EM1. And then opt one, which is going to be EM2. And do we want to proceed? Yes. Awesome. So now we can see that our interface is available. Let's go ahead and actually give this this particular interface an IP address. So we're going to go and hit number two. We're going to be working with opt one, so three. Enter the, the new IPv4 address. So remember, when we set up our host only, we set it up as a 192.168.16.0. So the network is what that. Uh, so let's go ahead and put that in here. And we want to give it a, a host address as well. So I'm going to give it 10. We are dealing with a subnet of 24. 
Am I going to be dealing with a upstream gateway? I am not right now. Uh, I am not going to set the IPv6 right now. Do we want DHCP on this interface turned on? And the, and the answer to this is no, because we remember we intentionally turned off DHCP. So in this particular network that we're configuring, it's only static IP addresses. So we're going to set, set, set no for this. Do I want the web configurator? Sure. look at the configurations and bing bang boom we have our IP address set on this interface and there you go this was uh, setting up a host only uh, VMware network into PFSense turning off DHCP on VMware and turning off DHCP in PFSense so there's no dynamic addresses happening here uh, and then we set the static IP address on the opt1 interface. There you go. If you're enjoying these videos, please like and subscribe. That would be great. And uh, I'll talk to you soon. Thanks, everybody. Bye.